All right, y'all. So first of all, let us pray. Father God, in the name of Jesus, thank you for the food. I give you glory, praise, and honor, God. In Jesus' name, I thank you. Amen. Amen. Bless those Lord who don't have them all this time, God. In Jesus' name, amen. Praise God. Amen. Y'all, in the words of MC Hammer, we got to pray just to make it today. We got to pray. Yes, y'all, we got to pray just to make it today. So what do I have here? First of all, I have some Jersey Mike's. Okay, so I have a bacon, lettuce, and tomato. I asked them to put cheese on it. Did they put cheese on here? I thought I told them to put cheese. Yeah, they put a little cheese on there. And this is their regular one for like $7 and change. So doesn't that look good? Mmm. -hmm. And I have me some cucumbers, of course. Y'all know I like cucumbers, and these are English cucumbers. So I'm about to just saturate those with some dressing. But I had added I added vinegar to it, you know, so that it could, you know what I'm saying, get the little bit of whatever that was in there. But, all right, let that marinate for a little bit. I got me some lemonade. I got me some wonderful sea salt and vinegar chips. These are by Miss Vicky's. Hey, Miss Vicky. All right, y'all. So it's been a week. Okay. Mm. I have to try these. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Just how I like them. Mm mm mm. Yo, these are good. Mm. Mm mm mm. Mm mm mm. It's been a week. Mm -hmm. You know, working from home is a good thing. But you know something? When you decide to work from home, you have to make sure that you put things in place. Yep. Mm. You have to set the atmosphere. Mm -hmm. You have to put yourself on a schedule as far as how you're going to do things. Because if you don't, you will find yourself not focused. And it's very important to stay focused when you're working from home because your boss is paying you to do a job. Amen. Even if you have your own business and you're working from home, if you're not focused, you're going to be wasting time. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. And my homegirl said in the temptation, time is money. My money. <laughs> I love that movie. <laughs> they asked us any of that for us. She said, poems got to get greased. <laughs> Y'all ain't my only group. <laughs> I love that movie. The Temptations. Netflix needs to stop playing and put that on Netflix. They need to put that. And they need to put the five heartbeats, okay? They need to put that so bad on Netflix that it's not even funny, okay? They need to do that. But anyway, like I was saying, you got to make sure when you're, 
when you're working from home, you got to really set up shop. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And I say that because if not, you're going to be in trouble. <laughs> yeah, you're going to be in trouble. Okay, wait a minute. Mm. Wait a minute, I got to pull up my chair. Hold on. funny whole time all right so mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay so I'm back oh so good wait y'all this sandwich has Bacon, lettuce, tomato, cheese, pickles. Mmm. And I asked him to put onions. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. 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 so good. So good. Mm, mm, mm. And I told him to put an extra bacon. So I did. Mm, mm, mm. 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 If y'all have a Jersey Mike's near y'all. Oh, there's some Jersey Mike's. Mmm. That is so good. Oh, Leon. Really mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. 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 Y'all. Um. Like I was saying about working from home. You have to really, you know, have a plan as far as what you're going to do, how you're going to start to do your day and all of that. You got to have a, like a schedule. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. Very important. Because even if, it, like I say, you're working for yourself from home, you don't want to be wasting your time. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, hmm Very, very good. So, I gotta have a schedule. About to drink me some lemonade. Mm. So that's that as far as the working from home. And you know what? I was able to find on at Office Depot this like cubicle thing. It's not called a cubicle, but it only costs like thirty something dollars, like thirty two dollars. It's not a cubicle. It's one of those like folding um, dividers, you know. And I just need one for the small space I have. Um, as far as what I'm using for my office, I mean, it's big enough, but. One would do the job just fine. One is just fine. And, um, yeah, so it's like 30 something dollars. Excuse me. And that just blocks out any kind of noise or anything like that. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Another thing I want to talk about is 
you know, for those of you, the landlords, they're canceling the rent for three months. I mean, that's wonderful. But please don't think that you're not going to have to pay that back rent once it's over. I'm telling you, cancel rent is another way of saying that the rental payments, they're going to be deferred and they're not going to evict or anything like that. But when that thing expires, if you don't have all of that rent, if it's two months or three months, if you don't have all of that rent, when that thing expires, you're going to be in trouble. So I'm telling people, make if you have the rent money, pay your rent. If you have your mortgage, pay it. Pay it. You know what? I know people saying they got to make a choice between paying food or, you know, paying rent. Well, what was they doing? And I'm not trying to be... I'm not trying to be disrespectful. So, you know what? I'm not going to say that because it's going to come out like I'm just trying to be disrespectful. It's like, if you got to take $100 from your rent, that's okay. But it's like, don't be just, oh, I'm not going to pay my rent because we live in rent-free for three months or whatever. Because when that courtesy expires, you're going to have to pay all your rent. All of that back months that you didn't pay, you're going to have to pay it. And they don't want to hear no excuses. Now, if it says something like, the rent will be null and void and um, you will not have to pay any rent for the two months and we won't look for it when the courtesy expires. That's different. I'm telling y'all, you got to read the fine print and stuff because people be trying to be slick. You got to read the fine print and stuff. I'm telling y'all. Go home. With insurance payments. Okay, a lot of these companies, they're allowing people to defer payments for like three and four months. But all that means is once that deferment is up and it expires, them insurance companies is going to want their money for the time that, you know what I'm saying? For the time that they extended it. They're going to want their money once that extension expires, honey, ain't nobody doing no free stuff like that. Ain't nobody doing no free stuff like that. Mm -mm. It's like you got to read the fine print because if not, you'll be in trouble. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. A lot of people think, oh, my landlord was allowing me to, you know, um, not pay rent for a whole month. He's saying I could, you know, skip rent and I don't got to worry about it. Well, let's say your rent is $500. So let's just say for March, for April and May, the landlord said, you know what? I'm canceling the rent for April and May. But June 1st is over. April, May, and June 1st rent is going to have to be paid on June 1st or the 5th, you know. I'm telling y'all, read the fine print. Read the fine print. got to read the fine People, read the fine print so that you don't have yourself in no bad situation. Get it in writing. If they're saying that, you know what? You wouldn't have to pay April and May's rent. You would only have to pay June. Get it in writing. Get it in writing writing because let me tell you something people be slick people be slicker than slick so don't get so happy until you get something in writing how the lady on the courthouse said it um that judge say it forget it write it regret it get it in writing get it in writing yep Mm mm mm. Mm. Mm 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 mm. mm. That way, you won't find yourself in a bad situation. Okay? That way, you won't be looking like, uh, you know? That way, it's like I said, you won't be finding yourself in a bad situation. Get it in writing. 
This is tasty. Mmm. -hmm. Mm -hmm. Delicious. I'm still gonna do my song reactions. So don't worry, I haven't forgot. I'm still gonna do them. It's just been such a busy week. You know, we're working and working from home and all of that. And it's just been a real busy week because y'all know when I get off of the job, y'all know I got to, you know what I'm saying, mother the children. So it's just been real busy, y'all. So get that stuff in writing. It was someone, something else I need to say. Y'all better get y'all jersey mics. Mm -hmm. And if you don't like seeing me eating my mukbang, don't watch. Mmm. Mmm. Mm, 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 mm. 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 I'm going like this for now. Until we talk again. Be blessed. Bye now.